Today in this video, we will be doing the box nibbles, which is a Linux based box. And the IP address for this box is 10.10.10.75. And this box is marked as E. It was released on 13 January 2018. Let's start with the enumeration and nmap scan. So nmap dash s capital B for the version dash s capital G for the default script that we'll be using dash capital A for the aggressive scan and the IP address of the box. Okay. This will take up some time, so let me pause the video till then. So our nmap scan is not complete. Okay. So two services are running: port 22 and port 80. Port 22 SSH and port 20 HTTP Apache HTTP 2.4.18. Okay. Let's move towards the Apache 10 10 10 dot 75. So hello world. Hello world is there. Okay. There is nothing interesting. Let me copy this directory and paste it over here. Nibble blog. Nibbles. Yum yum. So here is this block. Okay. Uh, let me do the dirbuster on this block too. Dirbuster. On this nibble block. On this URL. Copy this URL. HTTP paste it over here or ten dot ten dot ten dot seventy five table okay and yeah we'll be using the what is as user share we'll be at user share did buster and word lists I'll be using two point three medium okay yeah so let's start Oh, I didn't mention the post. 10, 10, 10, 2, 75. Yeah. We found icons, which is a directory. Nibble blog. Okay, okay. So this dear buster might take up some time. Okay. Till then let me hit a trial on this admin tool and if we can find the admin page. Nibble blog admin. We put admin.php. Okay, we found a nibble blog admin page. Dirbuster and now found it. I found it by hidden trial method. So let me see the password for this nibble blog. Default password. It says the default password is at the credential. So yeah, so the default password is admin and the password is nibbles. The default user is admin. And the password is nibbles. This is not default, we have to fuzz it. Okay, so it was like my own guess. Okay. So nibble block 4.0.3. Settings, 
was yum yum okay so the thing of the block is 4.0.3 coffee okay yeah let me see if there is an exploit for the same it was still running it was 4.3 vulnerability So arbitrary file will meta exploit. Okay, so meta exploit file upload is possible. Why we have a console? Yeah, so MFS console is firing up. Okay. We'll search for enable block. Okay. So, yeah. Search. Nibble. So this is the exploit that we'll be using. Copy. We use this exploit. Show options. Set our host as ten dot ten dot ten dot so it's and yeah. Probably run. Okay, yeah. Oh, username password. Set username. As uh, admin. Set password as nibbles. Let's see if we can. Enable to log in. Let me just try again. No, no, no. Yeah. The you the RF set is ten 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 seventy five. And the oh sorry, we didn't find the set you are set target. You are I to um not this nibble blocks. Nibble block. Okay, we found a meta session. Okay. Yeah, so let's we do deleted email dot php. Okay. Is it to ls? Still okay. Now. The meta session is still okay. Okay, so we got a meta prediction db dot xml. We got db dot xml. We do this info. Enable generic. X eighty six sixty four. Okay, so we have set up payload at X eighty six, but the machine architecture is X sixty four. Okay, so yeah, we have to you know no 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 the machine architecture is X eighty six sixty four. Okay, so yeah, yeah, this shell is now complete. We can move towards the uh, uh, present working directory. CD this ls CD home ls CD nibbler okay. ls cat user dot txt okay. yeah we got a user flag okay so now is the privilege escalation part. Okay. Let's uh, okay. Yeah. So let me create a Python script. Python. Okay. Go to a shell. Okay. Yeah. LS. Yeah. The shell is active. Python. Three. Dash C. Import. Import PTY okay. PTY dot spawn dash bin dash bash okay. 
Virginia. Nibbler and the nipples from Python. Yeah. So yeah, CD. Yes. LS. Yeah. If you move towards CD home. LS. CD nibbler. and yeah if we yeah there is a zip file over here I guess yeah personal load zip let me just unarchive the zip unzip archive zip personal load zip yes okay we got monitor.sh so we have to use the monitor.sh and yeah so uh, what do you the ls.lh so uh, cd personal ls cd stuff monitor.sh so yeah so monitor.sh i guess ch mod 7 and permissions the yeah execution permission we can run commands through this script sh script monitor sh so if i do echo cat dash root dash root txt yeah and yeah monitor sh You might get the root flag. No, you didn't get the root flag. Uh, no. 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 If we do sudo dash u root and that monitor dot sh. Okay, we got the okay 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 we got the root flag yeah so thank you